Hi, my name is David. Today we're going to do a free code camp tutorial about the radio buttons. So radio buttons are pretty much think multiple choice. And when you click on the, the multiple, it gets highlighted. It, the circle fills up with black. And then if you click it on the one, you can only pick one out of the, all the choices you have. So it's a type of input. And basically, this is the syntax we want to use, is that we create the, the label tag, the label element, and you want to nest this input within it. And then basically to indicate that is a radio, you just put type because radio. And the other one, like we have a type that be text as well. So, and it's the same, the best practice is that we put a for attribute to a label and with a value that matches the ID and we put an ID attribute to inside the input. So that you, we see that this matches. And then, so for this exercise, we want to add a pair of radio to your forms. So uh, we can just do this by looking at the, the test. All right, so you, your page have two radio button elements, OK? And then also the last one said it should be inside the form tag. So we can do that inside here to where to place it. OK, so we just want to. A lot of times you, we can just copy and paste the, these examples. So we want two of them, right? One, two. Okay, I know that the syntax, so the formatting, okay. So we have this form element and then we have this label and label and we can see here, okay. So these are the two radio elements. The radio buttons should be given the name attributes of indoor outdoor. So it's already have it there. Name indoor outdoor, name indoor outdoor. Each of your two radio elements should be nested within its own label. So we can see, I can enter it here. So this is what it means by it's nested. It's in between these label elements. Each of the label elements have a closing tag. So this is the closing tag and this is the closing tag. And one of your radio buttons should have the label indoor. So we see this is indoor. And now we still have an outdoor one. So we just change this to outdoor. And we can see here indoor, outdoor. And we can see this is what I mean, like you only press one of them at the time. So that's it. Thank you.